Hello guys, <clears throat> hope I am coming on time. Well, my name is Abdikirim Ramain. I am your coach and your trainer in swing trading. And today we try to see um, what is bull and bear market because uh, I got a lot of questions like this. And what is it for you this when you say bear, uh, bear, uh, bull or market? What is it? And uh, how do you know that we have bull or bear market? And what is for you? What is it? Okay. Is it the whole market? Is it stocks? Is it uh, what is it? So, please, guys, before we begin, if you are uh, uh, watching, <clears throat> please try to subscribe if you have not subscribed to my channel in order to get uh, more of these videos or try to share it in Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter, or wherever you are, just to spread the word, okay? Now, uh, let's begin with just uh, something very, very general, which is, uh, when we speak, when we say bull, or when we say bear market, what does it mean? Now, when we say bull, it just means that the whole market is moving up. Most of the time, for many months, it could be even one year or two years or three years. Sometimes you, you see five, six, seven years, which is like a very, very good market, especially for investors. Okay, so for example, if you look uh, at Dow Jones, I will show you uh, what are the years that are bull and what are the years that are bear. Now, bear, it means that the market is going into a downtrend after, after a bull, because when the bull finishes, here it comes what we call a bear market bear market people begin to sell because they get scared or because they have a lot of a lot of uh, profits and others they sell short and this is how the market works it means the market is not always going up sometimes it's going up for a long time sometimes it go down it goes down that's the market so if you you are you uh, uh, you follow the market, let's say, but uh, understand that this bull or bear market, in general, uh, we speak about people who stay longer. Okay. So, for example, day traders, they are not interested in what we call the bull or bear market. They have bull and bear market each day if the day is good people they buy long and the day traders they make money now if the day is bad or what we call bad what they do they sell short and they make money so for them there is no this idea of bull of uh, bull or market it doesn't mean nothing for them that's why you should be uh, you should be you should understand these ideas uh, ideas about bull and bear Bull and bear, it means mostly, if you speak about swing trading, when there is uh, some, uh, some trends, some good trends up, for example, okay, this is part of the bull, okay, but uh, sometimes the bull stays many years, and you see that the, that the market is going up and up and up, okay, so uh, let's, uh, if, we, if we want to uh, give you an idea, about about we can speak about investing first we try to go to the chart and i will show you um let me see here show you
Okay, as you can see, <clears throat> so this is the chart of Dow Jones, as you can see here. Um, now, so this is a daily. So daily, as you can see, we are not speaking about, uh, speaking about daily. We try to speak about, for example, yearly. Okay, this is what I told you before, I told you last week, that the candlestick could be green, last week it was red. I told you last week, if you can remember, that if 285.10, 285.93, so that's why this sense that we have makes the candlestick, the tail, makes it green. If you come, for example, last year, uh, last, uh, uh, last, uh, last live, last uh, Sunday, or uh, last Monday, if you can remember, you you have seen that the, that the that the, this candlestick was red because the price, the last price, was down from last from last uh, uh, last price for last year. Okay, last, last year the last price was $285.10. This is the last price that the Dow Jones has on 2019, 31st of December. So it is the same price as 285, but, but instead of 10, we have 93. That's why the candlestick is green. So now when we speak about bull, you can see that all these years were, were bull. Okay? So you see green here. Green. Green, it means that uh, the stock market 2009 was a good year compared to 2008. 2008. Okay? So uh, from $132.67, it goes down to 74 Point fifty. You see how much the market has gone uh, down. This is a bear market. Now we can see bear market. We can speak it about one year. It could be. It could be th also three years here. Bear market for three years. One. Okay. One. From one sixteen dollars, it goes to ninety six. From one seven, it goes to seventy nine. But it's still going down. From 99.80, it goes here 100, it goes to 72. So it is still going down, going down. So these three years are bear market, which is uh, 2000, 2001, 2002. Now, 2003 was a good year because the stock market goes from 84, it goes to 104. So uh, many stocks have been going up. It means most of the stocks have been going up. Sometimes it is just a little bit here and there. It means there is nothing. But sometimes it is so big. Like, like for example, uh, 2016, 2017. It was an excellent year. 190, uh, 198, it goes to 247. But understand that Dow Jones is just the average. There are some stocks that do better. 2018 is a bear market is a bear market the stock market has gone down now 2019 229 it goes to 285 which was a very very good year now this year is it a bear or uh, is it a bear or uh, or a bull market so here you can see that it is break even it's not doing as much as last year it's the same but we have um, uh, we have uh, some in October, November, December. We have two months and some. And we will see if the stock market continues to go up and it becomes green. Uh, very, very clean with, a, with, a, with a, a candlestick, for example, like this. You should see uh, a box, a rectangle or a square that it is filled with green. Because, uh, because from the open... The open of this year is 285.93 cents. 
$85.93. This is the open. Now, if the market continues to go up, you will see it will be filled in the uh, up. Okay? If it goes down, it will be red. Okay? So we will never know until the end finish, finishes. Okay? So uh, this is how we look at. Now, uh, there is another thing. There is another thing I will uh, I will just try to explain is that uh, um, there are some fluctuations about the trends, smaller trends in the bull market, and you find smaller trends in bear market also. Okay. So let's go to the chart again and I will explain to you uh, let's say uh, let's say uh, we take now this year for example what did happen this year now let's take for example let's take take a monthly and we see okay look now if you see that three months we have a bear market. We have January, February, March. Now, these three months, because of coronavirus, uh, coronavirus uh, uh, news, the market has collapsed. And now, the, from March, or from April, especially April, it's the end of March, April, so April until now, it is a bull, as you can see. Now we, we have bought here at the end of March, because at the end of March it was green. Now if you took, uh, for example, the, the weekly, you will see better. Okay, see here. So the weekly begins with, the week begins with 27 March. Okay, 190, 01, it goes to 216, it goes to 225, uh, you see, and you see uh, one month is good, one month uh, is bad, now this is weekly, so some weeks are good, some so the more you get details, the more you see well, bear or bull, but, uh, but this is just a small, okay, this is just a small, now if you speak about daily, speak about daily you can see that here we have a bear then we have small bull bear and small bull but uh, generally uh, for me i don't use bear and um, um uh, i don't use uh, i use bear or bull for years for the years i don't use them for months or for uh, but you you can uh, you can adapt yourself you can use them you can use them as you wish because it it, it doesn't matter the most important thing you can always think about are you making money in the month that that the whole market is good are you making money that is what's the most important thing this is the average okay this is the average if i tell you that for example last year 2019 it was an excellent year now for you when you trade or you invest or whatever you do, did you make money? If you say yes, it means you are with the average. You are with, with what the market has given. But uh, there are some people who, even if it is a bear market, they can make money because they sell short and they put, uh, put options. They can use uh, index in the ET, um, ETF indexes, ETFs and a lot of stuff. So these are the elite, these are the few that always when we speak about, when you say 5% are making money, that is the 5% or 10% that are making money each year and they, wherever it is the market they are making money. Because if you are an investor, if, if, if one year is bad, it is bad. Because your stocks, they will fall uh, according to the average of the whole market. Not uh, your stocks are going up and the whole market is going down. So, if you are an investor, you will bear 
mostly what the market is doing but if you are a swing trader for example you can sell short and the trend there is a trend going down you can make money also you can uh, buy uh, uh, puts or uh, uh, you sell short or whatever you do it means you are with the with trading not investing okay so let's go to um, uh, hello uh, 1982 uh, Vinmar. Uh, hello top series hello Karim what are your thoughts on the impact of two 2020 election on the stock market hello Karim Herman Herman Fabian hello Karim. now uh, for me um, you ask me about the elections So, for me, I am following very, very well what's going on into the market. In November 3rd, we begin to see the news about the elections and if Trump has won or Joe Biden has won. This has an impact on the stock market. I don't know what's going, what will be going on because, I, as I told you, uh, I, I trade what I see. I don't trade the future, so I don't predict. So you ask me what will happen? I have no idea. No idea what will happen. As I don't know what will happen to the stocks. Okay? So this is uh, when you follow the trading, you should follow this uh, stuff. Okay? Um, and the impact of 2020 election, we didn't see yet. yet. If you see the market is going up, going up, going up, and we go to November going up, going up, December going up, it means that this election uh, has made good for the stock market. But uh, what if uh, what if the stock market collapse? Uh, maybe the news, maybe the people they are they are not uh, satisfied with uh, uh, with elections or what they expect or whatever. Maybe the market will collapse. Maybe it will be going up. So no one knows. Even this year, when the market has been going down in the uh, end of February and end of March, it has been going down, but it stops. But, uh, but in the real economy, did the economy uh, become good uh, in, in, uh, uh, in May, in uh, April? No. In May, in June, July, a lot of companies, uh, they uh, lost uh, their money. Some they stop, some they go, go bankrupt. So, you know, uh, we, we have a lot of trouble because uh, uh, coronavirus is still hitting businesses and people and a lot of stuff. So, understand that we are still in a crisis, like an economic crisis, okay? Like, uh, like uh, although this crisis does, did not touch the stock market, it touched only one month, one month a week. But understand that uh, the crisis is still there. People are still, there are some places they don't go to school. Uh, some uh, businesses they uh, shut off. It means there is no business anymore. Um, uh, I see a lot of, uh, lot of uh, uh, like Disney, Disney, Walt Disney shut a lot of places. Uh, you see a lot of uh, attractions, a lot of uh, attractions for ki ch children, for kids. In this summer they shut and they open only in the summer and then they shut. It means understand that these businesses they got they got lost. It means they have a lot of pressure on them. But it's good for us since we are in the stock market. The stock market is doing good. Only one month that you see that it is bad. But uh, in in May, from May to now to October, we are doing good. And if you don't make money from April to now, it means it means you have some real problem in your strategies. All the market is going down. So what, what makes you choose the bad stocks? Okay? So this, you should understand that there is a correlation between what's going on in the market and what is your opinion about the market. Sometimes you, you choose some stocks uh, to lose money. You must have chosen some volatile stocks. Because you have more risk taken. Because you want more money. For example, you go to a penny stock and you want to have 100%, 200%, 300% or whatever in that stock. So you put a lot of money in it and you understand that it is, uh, it is very, very risky. And I have made a, 
uh, before a live about risky trades. Okay, so uh, for us now, uh, since uh, April, all these months, we are doing excellent. Okay, so if we, if we, if I take you again to the month to the monthly of Dow Jones, okay, now. If we take the monthly, we will see. So, now this is what? This is last year. So, I will put a line on last year. This is last year. So, we are not interested in last year. We are interested only in this year. So, January, a little bit down. February and March were worse. So this is the... If you are an investor, you will see that all... That you have lost a lot of money here. But you should see money coming back here. If you keep the same stocks, when they go down, they go up, you will keep the uh, same money. But... Now, uh, if you are a trader and uh, you have lost money here because you don't know... Uh, you don't know uh, what to do, what to search, and the stock is going down and you buy long, so you get uh, smashed uh, by the market, so you will lose a lot of money. But here, if you don't choose the good, good stocks, you will have a problem also, because you will be still losing money, and the market is still going up. Because, For example, May, uh, of, uh, April is good, May is good, June is good, July is good. Uh, what is it? August is good. It's excellent. Now, in September, it goes down a little bit. Not, not that much. For example, Dow Jones, from two, 283, it goes down to 277. It is only $6. So, even if you have uh, stocks, you, you would not be losing a lot of money. Uh, now, from 279, it goes to 85. Okay, so six dollars. So what you lost here, what you lost in uh, in September, you make it in uh, uh, in uh, what is it here? Yes, well, what you lost in September, in October, you make it, and we are still uh, we are still in just the beginning of October. We have also uh, twenty days. Uh, it means in this October, uh, it might continue to go up, we'll go up, and we might, we might go for the high of this year, 295.85, we might go there and we cross, and the, the bull market or the market will be going up. So we, ha we are still having November and December, okay? So this is for, uh, for the thing. Okay. Now, uh, guys, uh, this live I don't want to go uh, too much uh, about. I, I want just to make it uh, uh, smaller uh, live, not a very big live. So please, guys, if you have questions, uh, please ask me questions, uh, and then I can um, um, I can answer your questions right now before uh, we leave. Okay, so um, uh, as uh, we see in our uh, uh, search, we find more stocks in this October uh, compared to September, which is normal, which is normal. When the market moves uh, good, you will find more stocks that move up and you can buy and we can uh, make uh, some money. So guys, uh, since you are listening, if you have uh, any other questions about uh, bull or bear or about the market, uh, please let me know before we finish the live. So I will be waiting for you guys. I see that uh, most of you have no questions, <laughs> which is very funny. So, um, 
if if you have an investment Herman Mann says how we know bull market start okay now Herman let's say you have been in my subscription I just give you an example silver subscription or uh, what you call what is the other one basic subscription or I give those information because those information are based on the chart on my techniques so to tell you that this is the beginning I tell I tell for example if you go to my videos in 2000 um, end of 2018 in December 26 2018 after one week or two I ask my subscribers to begin to buy I showed them because they know how to search I showed them some stocks uh, I showed them uh, uh, how to search for all the weeks and they begin making money so these things these things when I see there is a change in the trend I will tell my students okay so but this information you will never find online for free the reason for that it's it, it is an expertise it is a skill that it is based on something real when you see when I see the chart of any stock I will tell you that this stock has a probability of going up or going down according to what I see now you say to me how do you know I know but what because whenever the stock market moves I see the people who are moving it it means I don't know who they are but I see the hands okay if you go to my uh, YouTube channel uh, after in uh, in uh, April when I see the market has been going up I told I told you guys if you have been here you will see that I have been to but I will not tell you the first week second week third week no I will not tell you because this is this is uh, 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 information I give to my subscribers because they pay because they pay me when is the right uh, time to buy and I show them stocks even before okay I show them even stocks before that they are doing good we have been with Apple we have been so I will I will just show you where we have been before at least you have an idea now uh, there is another thing I will tell you guys that my trades are verified it means when they say to my students okay uh, I see uh, uh, today we should buy Apple an example I bought it when they see it in the account okay they see it it means I can't hide and after two months or three months I say oh I have bought uh, Apple here now no one will, no one will believe you but for me I give them the chance to to believe what they see it means it is a strategies it is a strategies there are techniques that you should you should learn it, it's not just uh, uh, someone tells you oh here you buy no you should ask me why why I should buy here what did you see that I don't see okay so that's that's the, the thing now um, <clears throat> so there are many many things you should see and these are criteria that I developed through the years and uh, some people who are like uh, professional they can they can uh, see it also because it is because trading has the same basics basics is to know the reverse to know when the when the trend is going up when the trend stops these all the people who work in the, in the trends most of the people who uh, who make money from trends they will tell you this and this and that but if you go to some other people online who in general they they don't trade they see other videos of other people and they ask you no 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 here you should because of this of this it didn't work you show him another place he say why don't we, uh, why why uh, why the stock market doesn't grow uh, go here why here why here why here he will never t he he can never answer you because it is not his techniques 
and he does he didn't trade and he doesn't believe in them for me i do what i believe in and i show it to the guys and they make uh, uh, they make money also okay so stocks and uh, uh, trends uh, let's see let's i uh, show you let's uh, show you the chart I have uh, uh, for, for months. No, let's see. Let's do the daily. Now, if I give you, for example, Apple, okay, look. Now, Apple, we bought it. If you go to my chart, uh, if you go to my uh, training, we have bought it in this area here. At uh, the beginning of the trend. Okay? So, here the downtrend. Here the uptrend. Now, in order to know this, this is not like this, is not like this, is not like this. Although, although all of them are the same, you, ch you check them, they are the same. But in real, they are not. They are techniques. And we, we have, we have traded, 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 traded until here. And then we sold. We sold when uh, uh, when the trend has stopped, and it is true that it has stopped. Now, how do I know? This is my techniques. I can uh, I cannot just give you my techniques for free. So it's a training, and um, and you should uh, uh, you should either be subscriber or you order my uh, my any one of my trading. Okay. So this is just. Uh, 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 for example, uh, we have done uh, Facebook also. Just an example. The same thing. We bought them in the same thing. Okay? Now we bought Tesla also. And we bought other stocks. Tesla also. We bought it. And uh, we bought other stocks that are not known. Okay? Uh, we bought Zoom, for example. We bought, uh, we traded last year and this year. Okay, see, see how how Zoom. We we uh, have traded it a little bit, not that much. And then we have a gap up, and you see that. So there are a lot of uh, lot of stuff. We did, I didn't buy gold and silver and the other stuff. The because uh, most of it uh, was not in the radar, and I don't want to to go to this. Uh, uh, gold and silver that's why I don't uh, this year I didn't buy them okay I didn't buy them now let's go to um, uh, top series said Karim how is ACRS Now listen, listen. Um, like this kind of stocks, they are penny stocks, and you can see there is a push. But you understand that here we have a gap up, and then it goes down. Here we have a gap up, also a long, long, long it go down, and it's going up and down, up and down until here. Now for me, if you, if you, if you want. To find stocks like this before they leave here, before you should try my strategies. It means you, I, I find these stocks daily. I find them daily. So you can find, anyone can find them daily and they can go uh, a lot, a lot. But you need, you need to work. Okay, like this. I see here. Uh, okay. You see, you see here, if you bought this stock from here to here, all these two months, there is nothing. You, you will be making no money if you bought it here at, let's say, at uh, 263 and here 266. Uh, October and here, what is it? July. From July to October, you, 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 will, you will not make any money. From July to October. You will make no money, but uh, you make money only this week, one week or two. So these kind of stocks, I can find them 
and all my students they can find them and uh, this year a lot of, of my students uh, they get uh, uh, they got a lot of stocks like these uh, I told you uh, hello uh, Magthira how are you uh, top series uh, I I have made I have uh, uh, some uh, many of my students who have made who showed me some uh, it means uh, a very 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 good traits like this but they are very dangerous I told them you are playing with fire because you can make a lot of money and you can lose a lot of money so be careful of this kind of stocks because penny stocks some are very very dangerous so be careful okay but there are techniques to find them and uh, you, uh, training level 2 I do the search each week I showed you I showed the guys the subscribers how to search for this kind of stocks and you can choose any stock with any price because it's not just penny stocks any kind of stocks even the stock is two hundred two thousand dollars you can find even Warren Buffett stock which is uh, uh, I think uh, Berkshire Hathaway I, I don't know how, how much is this thing now I said I think uh, 300 something let's uh, Let's go to Berkshire Hathaway. I didn't see it for a long time. Three hundred something. Yes, it's three hundred twenty-three thousand four hundred seventy dollars. So here, for example, it was two hundred sixty-five. So this is the trend. It doesn't matter how the stock is big or small, but you should follow the trend. Now, if you can find the trend. If you find the trend, you can make money. But if you don't know how to find it, you will never, uh, you will never make money. That's it. Now this year, uh, Mark Thera, we stopped at one forty, one forty percent. This is a big year because uh, because of uh, uh, because of uh, uh, since uh, April, April the market was so good we make one forty percent and then I sold all my stocks and then I bought uh, more and uh, we are saying uh, you know I always buy and sell but uh, uh, our um, our um, uh, what is it called our account we know we have a problem with our account because uh, e trade has not gives us our money when we do the split for example we have um, we have 50 let's say let's say 100 shares of apple for example at 500 dollar now uh, 100 shares normally it becomes 400 shares of 100 dollar but uh, the software uh, didn't didn't make the change so all the money that it made make it a loss and i asked them to to uh, to see it they, they told me we can't fix anything because the software it's not real it doesn't change especially splits so that's why i stopped using that e-trade uh, uh, demo account i stopped using it because it's, it's uh, 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 we have trouble all well uh, but we have we have made until 140 and then we stopped so now i am searching for another um, another account that it is for free and uh, if it can do the splits because uh, most of these free they don't go they don't uh, uh, take it as serious and for me i am doing serious thing but uh, you know they don't okay now, uh, when, the, when the trend is going down, the first day, second day, I sell. And I show my students why I sold. Because from uh, January until now, we have, made, we have seen, I think, 100 or 200 uh, stocks. Some of them have been, ha, ha, was not successful. So uh, when I see that the trade is not good, I exit the trade and they see it. It means I show them. I show them how, what to do in any situation. And this is the most important thing to do. Uh, top series said, go with the 
TM Amid Trade or Think or, or Think or Swim Broker. But uh, listen, if you you have a, a, a demo broker, it means a paper trading, and you have tried this year, and then you tell me if it works or no, because most of this uh, uh, this uh, paper trading. They, the, the software is not equipped to to uh, to change because this is a, is a company change it's not a stock change this is a company change the, the company that it changed the price from five hundred dollar to one hundred uh, to one hundred twenty five dollar for uh, uh, Apple four four one so understand that the software cannot change the broker thing, uh, cannot change this paper trading. But in real, yes. In real, uh, no problem, because they can't do problems for people. Okay? So in real, I, I own, at that time, Apple and Facebook and Zoom and Tesla. Uh, it's, uh, they do the split and I'm okay. So I have no problem. So uh, uh, top series, you should do and you should see a split and then you verify. If you don't verify, it's the same thing. Okay? If it's the same thing. Now, guys, uh, can you, uh, do you have any other questions? Because uh, the subject of today is very, very small. It doesn't need that much attention. I just uh, showed you that we have bull, we have bear. Now, uh, we have small trends going down. We have seen them. We have uh, a big trend now, but we don't know when it stops. So someone has said, uh, Top Series said, that uh, maybe the impact of 2020 elections, yes. And we have other things. When, when, the, uh, when the airports are open, and a lot of businesses, they do business, a lot of, there is a big hope. And the people, they put their money again into the stock market, and everything will be going up into, into a bull, a very big uh, bull trend. But now, something is good now. For, from, uh, from April to now, the market is good. But I don't know if it continues to the end of the year or to the next year. I don't know until we see the news. Because we are coming to a big news. We have also the news of coronavirus news, uh, drugs and vaccines. Because uh, Trump has said, oh, we should have some vac vaccines this year. So vaccines will change a lot of, uh, lot of stuff. Okay. Uh, Mark Thera said, what is your thoughts on the strategy I came across? Put 500 in when it gets to 750. Take out 500 and let the 200 remaining right up to 500 or longer. Hey, 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 listen, uh, Mark Thera. Mark Thera, this is not uh, this is not strategy. This is someone who who doesn't believe in what he is doing. Now, if you you are in a trend, you can go to my subscription, golden or silver. You see, when I sold my uh, my. Uh, Facebook or Apple test. You see when I sold. You see when I bought, when I sold. Why should I sell when the stock is giving you money? What is this? Uh, uh, you put uh, 500 and gets to 750. And who tells you that the, that the stock that the stock will will stop at 750? Now these people, because they are scared, they are scared. They try to, to, uh, to uh, it means they, they are not confident in what they are doing. Now you take, uh, you take profits, especially, especially if you have a gap up. If you have a big, if you have been uh, making money a long time, two months or three months, and then you see a big, uh, big, uh, a big gap up. Sometimes for me, I sell everything. I don't stay. I will show you, I will show you, uh, for example, um, I will show you Zoom, for example. Try to check Zoom. 
see, the stock was 325, it goes to 478. It's about 25%. And if you bought it here, see, if you bought it, let's say you bought it here at $124, it goes to 478. So if it is here, let's say 125 here, and uh, just it go it goes uh, it goes a few days and you sell it here and you leave all this money this is crazy if you do like like this guy you will be crazy this is not a strategy this is a person who uh, who gets scared because why he is scared it's just because he doesn't know how to trade because uh, I understand guys that uh, I will tell you something that uh, trends Following trends with a, with a good strategy, it is uh, you should have a lot of skills. It's not a game of children or of kids who are playing. Today I enter, after two days I uh, sold, uh, I will leave some money, I will... Uh, no, we don't do like that. Now I exit when I have something alarming. The market tells me you should exit now because you will never know what will happen. At the time I exit. Now you tell me what is this thing? Ah, they are techniques. I can't explain to you my techniques here. But for my subscription, let's say you subscribe for one month. You go to April when I bought, uh, uh, bought Apple, uh, Facebook, uh, mini stocks. You see them going up. Now sometimes when they go down, I see a danger. I will tell you if this stock goes to under this, I will sell and I will give you the reason. That is how I trade. It means I have rules. I have criteria that it should apply. It's not just uh, just because uh, uh, because the stock has gone uh, uh, five percent or two percent. I will sell. This is stupid. This is not uh, this is not swing trading. Swing trading is you stay to have a high percentage. But I I don't decide how much I get. It's the market who gives me. When the stock when the market. So I will just uh, try to explain this if uh, if uh, the thing works. Okay, I will explain to this. Okay, so this is I will give you your example what you said. Okay, so let's say the stock is five hundred dollars. Not uh, not uh, not. Uh, let's say your stock is five hundred dollars. It goes here to 750. Okay. And what do you what did you say? Take take out 500. Okay. Now. So here here you sell now the question i should ask you the question why here why you sell here do you have an answer what's the strategy now if the stock when you sell uh 500 okay and you leave here 250 dollars it goes Let's say it goes to 500 again. Okay? So, from 500 to 750, how much how much you make? It means what you make is 250. You take your 500 dollars. It means the idea is uh, you don't you don't lose your principal okay you don't lose your principal let's say this 250 becomes 500 so how much you are you are making you are making 500 dollars just in general okay i'm just giving in general okay you make 500 dollars 
But this is not the way we do it. So the way we do it, don't, don't, uh, don't mix uh, things. Try to see, I give you another example which is better than your example. Try to think like this, okay? I will give you an example, very clear example, okay? So please understand my example is more clear than yours. Don't, uh, don't expect the, the amount, okay? So, let's say you have the stock is $20, okay? It goes to $25. I don't know how, ma how, ma how many times or how much time, it's not important. Now you decide, okay? You have made $500, okay? Now you, you have put $2,000. In this trade. Now here, this two thousand dollars, you take it. This is your own principle. Okay, this is your own principle, and you risk five hundred dollars only. This is your profit. So your profit, you leave it. Your profit. Let's say the stock is $25. Now let's say it goes to $50. You double your money. Okay? You double your money. $500. Okay? So you make $500. You $500 double it to you make 1000 now 1000 1000 from uh, from 2000 it means you have made 50% profit now let's go to your if you don't from 20 you go to 25 uh, to 50 how much money you make Okay? 20, 20, 40, 20 and 20, it becomes 40, it's 100%, and you have 10, it becomes 100, 150% profit. Okay? So, Two thousand, it becomes five thousand dollars. So two thousand, it becomes five thousand dollars. One fifty percent. So how much you make? You have made three thousand dollars. If you don't take your money here, this is the mistake that you have done. This is your mistake. You stop your profit and you take your money and you think that you are safe. But you have left the money because this 2000, if it is here, you will be getting 3000. But since you take 2000 out, it is in your profit, uh, it is in your, in your uh, principal. You are not using $2,000 anymore. You are using only 500 profit. That's why. That's why all what you have made is 1,000. Now I ask you the question, which is better, 1,000 or 3,000? Now you tell me, yeah, wow, 3,000 is better. So what did I tell you? Your strategy is false. Because in swing trading, in swing trading, what is the good thing is that here is the good thing. I will, uh, I will uh, explain one more time. One more time. Okay. So twenty dollars. The stock the stock goes up. It goes to fifty. This is the trend. Now don't uh, don't uh, say how many days or how many months, how many weeks. I don't know. 
I don't know how many. Because for me, I don't know how many days, weeks, or months the trend will stop. But when the trend stops, it's going to the down. So, so until it's, it shows me that it is not going up anymore, in that situation, I exit. So this, you should have techniques. Let's say the stock had been going down like this. So, you have three techniques you should know. You should know when to buy, how to manage the trade in, in these months, days, weeks, or months, how to manage the stock, and then here, when to exit or when to sell or exit the trade okay i should not uh, i should not exit the trade here or here or here or here i should exit here this in order to know when to exit this is what i'm teaching i teach you when to enter how to manage when to sell and then you can make money so this is the things uh, I am teaching to the people. Now you tell me how do you know how is how is how you should get to my subscription, you should see my trades and you should follow me and then you understand because it is some uh, my my uh, my subscribers are following for many years. For many years in in, in these many years the market is going down. Uh, they will see how how uh, what should I do? Or what, uh, how I sell short? Uh, what is the stocks that I sell short? Why I sell them short? Uh, I show them how to do options. I show them many stuff. How to do the inverse ETFs. It means there are techniques. It's not just you do something and you forget about it. it sh you should manage your trades in bad and in good times. Okay? Uh, Hardal, hello Karim. Thanks for cleaning that up. Just uh, traded wood for gold <laughs> yes uh, you know uh, i'm telling you something i'm telling you something there is something that i always do uh, i will i will give you an example with zoom if i tell you this example you don't believe because uh, because uh, 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 I, I will i will just show you what happened with zoom and then i explain to you uh, i explain to you uh, how? Okay. Now, Zoom, I have traded with the guys here at the beginning when when, when it was an IPO. Uh, let's say here in um, uh, last year around uh, what is it here? Around uh, April. Let, let's say I give you uh, I give you weekly. Yes. Now look here, if I show you that in the first week, uh, in the, when, the start, when, the, uh, when it begins as an IPO, in the 18, um, 18 uh, it means at the end of the week, it is 18, but it is uh, before, uh, it means uh, it should be like 18, it could be 12 or 13, 13 April, until the stock was uh, 62, it goes to 100. We have been in this trade. If you go, especially the last uh, uh, subscription, not this uh, subscriptions, we have that. Now, from this here, we were. But I forgot about this. All this. See, from, uh, uh, from 28, uh, 28 uh, June 2019 until here, until... 7 of February. I did not see Zoom. I forgot about it. But when we have the big deal here, I was here in some time. So you see, you see that sometimes when you sell, you can buy again if you see that the stock has been going up. So uh, this, it is not just mistake, but it is something that happens because you will never know what is going on. So in order to understand this, um, I will I will explain it in here. 
okay i will explain it in here for you guys uh, just to get an idea how i trade so i have techniques that i showed always to my students for example for example we we continue with this example 20 dollars it goes to 50. i see 50 the stock goes down to 35. now let's say i sold here then uh, i see that the stock is coming back up it goes to 100. now i will buy it here i will buy it again buy it again now why i sold it here why i bought it here these are my techniques because sometimes when you sold it i sold it because i see something wrong it might go down go down 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 now it is two dollars okay so i exit because of my risk because i see i see i have made a lot of money in this stock so i should i should uh, i should manage my trade even if i do mistake and the stock come back again i will buy it again there is no there is no it's not a it's not a big deal for me because i have been i have been trading for since 2011 so for me buying and selling and uh, and buy again and buy again and buy again it happens always to me it depends on the, on the whole market situation if the market uh, there are a lot of stocks that have been going down but now everything is going up should i just say i don't buy i buy either the same stocks or I choose other stocks. This is how we trade. It means you should follow the market, follow stocks, put uh, put a list of stocks that you like to trade. When they go down, uh, it's not a way to buy. But when they come uh, come back up and you see an opportunity, you buy. But you should know when to buy. This is the most important thing. Not uh, not you go to an analyst and he asks you to buy a company. Uh, just because uh, 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 it makes cars like uh, Tesla, because it makes cars, because it makes uh, batteries. That's why you should buy Tesla. No, I don't buy Tesla every, every time. I buy it when the stock, when the people are buying, the true people. Okay? So you understand that buying and selling, when we say bull or, uh, or bear, bull or bear, it just shows you the, the mood of the market. If the market is good, you will find a lot of a lot yes there are some people who doesn't who don't know when to buy exactly they lose a lot of profits but if you are like me whenever something move i follow the market i follow stocks i follow them i have a very very long uh, 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 stocks that i like i like always to trade because they are strong there when they are going down i just leave them each two days, each one week, I just uh, see them where they are. If I find an opportunity to buy, and I see it's a good opportunity, I buy blindly. Because I follow my rules. But if uh, they are bad again, I will sell them again. So, this buying and selling, it is not, uh, it is not uh, something like a rock. You should be flexible. Flexible is like a day trader. Uh, the day begins good, he pay long. It goes up, it goes up, then he see that the, st the stock doesn't go up anymore, it's going down so, much, so fast. He will sell his uh, long position and he will short. Okay, I will just uh, show you this because this gives you an idea that you should be, uh, that you should be uh, flexible. Okay, so here is the deal. I always show these techniques for my students so this is where the day begins this is the open okay sometimes the open the stock is going up some candlesticks now some people here they begin they buy to go long it goes here it stops then you see this is the line okay then they see that the stock is going down 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 then it goes down 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 so if you don't sell short here or here or here if you don't sell short, you are not going to make money. You go here and you sell short here. And then the stock will come up and go up and up, up, up. You lose here. So the point, the point where to buy here, or you sell here or you sell short here or here. These are the techniques. The more, the more sophisticated you are, 
the more you will be able uh, to do this kind of trades okay it needs it needs that you practice one thing if you are a day trader keep many years doing day trading and don't stop doing a lot of things now you can uh, you can for example if you have other ideas you can leave some money for investing and I suggest, I always suggest for my students, don't mix the same account for trading and investing. Please, don't don't mix up. Even in the terms of tax, you should you should uh, you should not mix them. Uh, at least the other guy who do tax for you, it will be easy for him because uh, investing they are calculated uh, calculated uh, for the for the tax is different from uh, trades to uh, investment it's not the same if you hold the stock for uh, for one year more than one year the tax is only 16 percent 16 percent but uh, if you do uh, swing trading it's like an income an income it is with your brackets uh, of of, uh, of tax that you are in 25 percent or 30 percent 35 percent or uh, 12 percent i don't know where you are so it's an income but uh, when you are doing investment for 10 years or five years and you want to sell uh, you don't pay that much tax so that's why i guys i i ask you always to pay attention to all this stuff this stuff you should learn it doesn't come like this to you uh, you sleep and then it comes as a dreams like lessons and someone will show you the right way no one is it you are not profit and uh, no one uh, will be okay especially now in the future uh mark uh, thera said i was thinking of saving some uh, money for when the market tanks and buy okay so mark thera when do you think the market will tank let's say it takes five years to tank it means you are going to fire to wait five years and you put your money there and the, the market is going up going up going up people are making money every year every year every year every year and then you wait until the, the market tank it's just because you think you think that you will be smarter than the market you should not be smarter than the market if if you can't uh, uh, sell short yes but now the market is going up why are you are thinking about the market uh, it's it's like when you you are 20 years or 25 uh, years old and you say to me when you retire at 65 uh, you will go to travel the world because you have money but uh, but instead of waiting uh, 60 years you will never know that you die or you still and you don't even if you have millions of dollars at 65 or 70 you can't walk you can't hike you can't swim so you so the money the, the the happiness of the money that you have will never fulfill you because your body can't do that if you want to uh, to uh, travel the world it's time now to go and uh, make uh, have some money each year and go to another country and have fun why you wait until the 60 year 65 years or 70 to to go travel you see the ideas and you will never know what will happen tomorrow how can you think that you will live uh, 60 years 70 years maybe tomorrow you go to your work you get an accident you die maybe you have a uh, you go you have an accident you get you get handicapped and you will never walk even if you have millions of dollars what do you do with this with millions of dollars you can't so instead of waiting for something try to do what is necessary now now the market is going up you buy now one month two months three months you make money take this money and go have travel travel or buy a car or uh, take your wife or girlfriend or uh, take her to have uh, um, a trip or something and have fun why, why you are waiting for the future to do something that, uh, that this future it might come it might it might not come okay and i have just showed you the market the market all these years have been in a bull bull market i'm just explaining what is a bull market the whole market is in a bull market why you want a bear market now i will tell you uh, i will show you this uh, figure because uh, because uh, i think you uh, come late you didn't see okay let me let me show you something okay okay look i will show you 
Uh, this is the weekly. Okay? Now, I just make weekly in order to be, to be clear to see. So, this is the downtrend. Where the market, when you say the market tank, it tanked for one month. All the stocks tank like this. But, who tells you to buy here? Who? You can buy here and you lose money. Because the market is still going down. So, if I take the daily, I will show it's clear, more clear, the daily. So, this is the, this is the one month, end of February, end of March. Now, we, we have bought, we have bought in this section here. But you, how do you know when to buy? Maybe you have been waiting, 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 and then you see the stock market going up. And then you don't decide to buy. And then you tell me, oh, I'm waiting for another tank like this. But who tells you that the market will tank this year or next year or the other year? Now, I will show you the yearly to uh, make sure you understand. Now, the yearly. Okay. You see? You see the yearly? From 2008, it was a bad year for investors. 2009. Until now, the whole market is excellent, except for this one year or two uh, that it is little. And this year it go down and go up. But still, if you are an investor, you have been making from 2009 until today. You have made all these years making profit. But you are waiting for this year, 2008. But who tells you that 2008 will come? It has come this year because you see how the market is going down to this year. But you, you didn't buy. So you should make, you should wait for many years and then you do it again. But, uh, but understand that you will never know. Like when it goes low so fast, then I buy with that fence. What you think? Now what you think we have done with our students? What you, you are thinking about? We have done it. But my students, they are learning from me. I showed them where to buy when the market has done uh, in the begin in the end of uh, September, uh, end of March, the beginning of April of this year. You go to my subscription now. You see, you should see that I bought, for example, uh, Facebook, Apple, Tesla, uh, Zoom. You will go and you find them, and you tell me, "Oh, Karim, how do you know?" Yes, I know because I study the market, because I have techniques. And this is the true trades. It means you see them. And I ask, I say, okay, today I bought Apple. Tomorrow I, I bought Tesla. The other day I bought Zoom. The, the, my students, they have seen me when I bought. It means they see the videos and they are, and they are in, the, in my subscription. Now when I sell them, they see when I sell them and why. Okay? So understand the theory. Now you, you are asking questions. The question that you ask is, when should I buy? When should I sell? This is what I teach. This is what I teach. But I can't uh, just teach you here for free. This, uh, this uh, thing is about money. People, when they learn from me, they make, uh, they make money. Okay? I showed uh, some uh, flying stocks like, uh, like uh, penny stocks and say it's dangerous. You can do them, but I don't do that much. With penny stocks, I do only few people, few of the penny stocks. Some people have made a lot of money. One of the guys, he put eleven thousand in a stock. He made, uh, I think, he made uh, thirty-eight thousand in few days. From eleven thousand to thirty-eight, you know, you see, and he he has made them. But uh, but you, you know, you, you should know how to buy, what to do, and so on. It's not that easy. You should work. Thank you, uh, Mark Thera. But uh, understand, understand, Mark Thera, for me, I don't hold the knowledge for myself. My students, I give them everything. They ask me everything. They ask me, why you sell here? Why you buy here? Without they ask me, I explain. And because we are doing stocks, they see what I am buying, what I am selling. But even if the stock I bought and it is, it is not good, it's okay. Because it is part of the game. It's not all the stocks that you should buy, they will make a good. Some stocks you buy, they go down, so you, you sell them. This is part of the game. So you should, you should understand. It's like when you do, uh, when you are boxing. 
you uh, you uh, um, you uh, you fight uh, ten guys, you beat them. But when the one guy beats you, but later you beat that the same guy next year when you train better, you beat that guy that uh, next guy who beats you. Yeah, this is the, this is how uh, how uh, how the game of trading is working. You will never you would never have all of your trades are good. Some are bad, but you lose only a little bit. You're not go, you are not go, going to lose a lot of money because my strategy is you should not use. You should not do crazy trades. You, you are here to make money steadily. Make money, make money, make money, make money. But uh, not uh, you make money, you make too much money today and to, uh, tomorrow you lose all your money. Uh, this is not what I teach. Okay? Uh, hey, uh, Pablo. Hey, Karim. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, Pablo, uh, for coming. But you come too late. I know you are working, but uh, you come uh, too late, Pablo. I'm going. I'm going to um, um, uh, to stop the live because I, I have done one. Uh, normally, at 20 minutes, I want to stop, uh, except when the guys when they ask me questions, which is very very good. Okay, so uh, guys, it's something that it is like true. It means when I bought uh, when I bought stock, you can buy. All my students that I have taught, some are here watching. Some uh, they follow me in. Uh, in my subscriptions, I just teach them how to how to trade. But uh, they trade themselves. They find stocks that I I don't find because I don't I don't search because the whole market is big. You can you can find a good stock that I I, I have never seen it. It's a new stock, an IPO or another stock. So it doesn't mean that I I know everything. No, I know only what I search. All the stocks that I know and I put in a, in a checklist. That's it. But you know we have about 24,000 companies in America. So they are a lot. So for you, just just find some stocks that you can make money. That's it. Uh, Pablo said, yes, I get off at this uh, time. Now, uh, as I told you before, um, thank you very much, guys, uh, for uh, coming. Uh, I know some of them have asked the questions. I have answered them. And uh, understand that uh, I give always each week. Each week I give uh, what is the market doing, what are the stocks doing, uh, what are the stocks that we have as a, a playlist, as uh, we check them each week. And I will tell my guys, okay, this stock, if it reach here, buy. But if it, if it goes down right here, sell. Now I give them instructions. Some people they follow, they make money. That's it. It means uh, we are here to. I, I, I'm, I'm. My, my purpose is to make independent traders, not someone who follows me the whole life. But uh, I have friends who know how to trade. They trade like me. They have uh, uh, expertise, so they trade for themselves. And they tell me, okay, I have bought this, and I told him I have bought this. Uh, how much you make money for this? Uh, that's that's a simple thing. So they become friends. Uh, no more uh, subscribers or something, they are friends, and I know them for many years. So, it means we build a community that, uh, that when you trade good, you don't need anyone. You can even uh, develop my strategies to other strategies, it's your choice. You can add something, you, or you choose some kind of uh, uh, sectors or industries, I show them. If someone wants to specialize in, uh, uh, in one sector, but sometimes... Uh, one sector is doing bad. So you, if you if you go to only one sector, like energy sector, I find the uh, beginning of the year or last year, some people they doing that. I tell them no, this sector is doing bad. Do not go to that sector. Everybody who go to the sector, he invests or he trade, he lost money this year. But I tell them instead of going to this sector, go to this sector which is doing good. And these sectors they. Uh, they go to cycles. Sometimes energy sector is the best. Sometimes it is technology. Sometimes it is drugs. Sometimes it is company. It is uh, utilities. Sometimes it is uh, consumer uh, uh, companies. It, 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 it changes. Sometimes it is retail. So do not, do not, do not try to search. Whenever you find a good stock, you buy it. It doesn't matter where it is. Okay. So this is what I always uh, ask my uh, ask my students. And uh, even if you buy a stock and you get stuck in it, you don't know if it's good or bad. Some of the guys they send me an email. I answer them by email, 
if they ask me to make a video to explain a certain point that they don't understand I make a video and each, each week I, may, I put a lesson 20 minutes, 50 minutes or, or, or 40 minutes depending on the lesson I explain into details the, the problem and the solution and I give examples it means it means you get benefit from uh, subscriptions but uh, understand that uh, if you uh, for example if you want only to buy training to order training by ebooks which is cheaper uh, and or uh, training by videos it's your, it's your choice you can still ask me and I will answer you because the most important thing is you become my student but if you are not my student you are outside you can't ask me about my training specific uh, specificities or or details because I will not give you okay so this is just a normal thing now guys uh, thank you very much today is Sunday I hope the market continues to be good uh, we are in a big trend uh, I don't know what will happen maybe this uh, election it makes uh, stronger and stronger elections the uh, 2020 elections uh, we have go we have maybe good news about coronavirus uh, drugs and uh, maybe we have uh, some good news so uh, this end of the year it will be I think I think it will be good but I don't know because I don't trade the news I trade what I see if the market is, uh, is plumbing and going down I say I, uh, I, I will sell all my uh, positions long and I will ch uh, change them to other positions or I will wait so I'm not crazy to uh, to predict something in the future I don't predict anything if I don't see something I will not pretend there is something okay so guys thank you very much if you have questions you, you always go to uh, here uh, you go to my uh, to my uh, subscription uh, to my uh, description you find my email you find my website you you just uh, send me an email and I can help you okay so thank you guys very much uh, see you next week um, and uh, thank you very much